Hi Taurus, this is Jackie Tomlin. This is your general reading for the entire month of April 2017. Guys, don't forget to check out your weekly videos as well. This Sunday, the 26th, I will be on YouTube Live. I will be posting that time on my Twitter account, which also posts to my homepage, which is www.ms-swami.com. And if you're looking for a personal reading, uh, best times to reach me are between 1 p.m. and 1 a.m. Eastern. So Taurus, <clears throat> the biggest thing that I'm seeing for you guys for the month of April is a need for balance. And that need for balance is I'm looking at a busy, busy month for you guys. And this is both in your profession as well as your personal life. Uh, personal life looks like there's new doors opening, new opportunities. For some of you, you're further in your education or taking something maybe of the metaphysical realm, some kind of class, it could be yoga, something like that. Um, and that you're constantly making decisions and you're changing things up. It does look like that there is some um, good financial news coming in for you guys. And for some of you guys, it's uh, the signing of a contract. But I do want to warn, and this is leaning more towards your work and career of someone taking advantage of you or someone just really pushing your buttons there. So let's take a look. This is for Taurus, and this is for your entire month of April 2017. Taurus. We start with Major Arcana of the Empress, followed by the Six of Cups, the Queen of Wands, the King of Wands, the Four of Pentacles, and the Two of Wands. So let me break this down for you and I'll pull three more. We start with the Empress card, which indicates just everything good on the home front. There's... Um, the feeling of contentment, things are going your way, everything is going very smooth for you at home. The Six of Cups, this is uh, someone from your past, someone that you're going to reconnect with. Um, someone, I, I kind of described this, someone you're very happy to see, someone you haven't seen in many, many months. So definitely happy reunion there. And don't forget that I do see y'all surrounded by many people this month, okay? And there we have that the balance is restored. And this just, this falls with that person from the past. Uh, maybe some amendments or just, like I said, I see a lot of happiness with this person. And, and for a lot of you, this is gonna be completely unexpected. Now, moving forward, we have the King of Wands, we have the Four of Pentacles, and we have the Two of Wands. Normally, I don't throw out another zodiac sign to you guys, but for whatever reason, thinking Aries may resonate with some of you this month. Uh, King of Wands shows balance, but it also shows you guys need to slow down a little bit, because like I said, you do have a busy month. And, and remember that, because if you go through the month, and at some point in time, you're feeling a little bit out of sorts, just kind of be still, still your thoughts and just let things happen. Four Pentacles shows that, you know, you've got financial stability, but you're holding on to your money. So you're making wise financial decisions. You're not being frivolous. For some of you, you may be saving up for summer, but you're saving up for something. Two of Wands, the time of reflection, the time to see what worked well, what didn't work well, and revamping your goals in the month of April. Moving forward, we have the Seven of Wands, we have the Two of Pentacles, and then we have that Seven of Pentacles, okay? The Seven of Wands shows that you haven't completed all your obstacles or what all you're going through. There's still a little bit lingering around, but you're addressing it with a positive attitude. You're very hopeful, and you're taking these out one at a time. The Two of Pentacles, going back to that finances of uh, spending wisely and things like that, it does show that you're juggling a little bit financially at this time, but you are making the correct decisions. And then we have that Seven of Pentacles. Now, Taurus, if you're looking to for a job promotion, to switch careers, for new jobs, things like that, second jobs, this is definitely a good month for you. If you're unemployed, this is also a very, very strong month for you. Overall, financially, things work out fine for Taurus in the month of April. So, taking a look, guys, you only have one major arcana. The Empress. 
And the Empress says, everything well at home, happiness, contentment, uh, making the home your own, just everything going very well for you on the home front this month. So thank you for watching. Please take the time to like, share, and subscribe. See you guys soon. Bye.